Montana. Big sky country. The treasure state. People got a lot of names for it. I just call it home. Lived here my whole life. Still amazed at how beautiful it is. Maybe that's what blinded us to how ugly the people were getting. Good day to you, brother. You don't understand. No one took these groups seriously. They were different. Religious. Militant. I mean, it was a goddamn cult. The collapse is upon us, my children. They started buying up every farm for miles. Then the radio station. Not long after that, they even had the fucking cops. Their own sovereign religious state. Built right here. Under our noses. Ain't no one coming to help us. The government can't do shit. We're on our own. Friends, we save those lost souls, whether they want to be saved or not. People don't want to believe groups like this exist. People are scared, man. Some will wish to harm us. Some will wish to destroy all that we have built here together. Some will betray us. We don't know what he's capable of. Ow. Who? Their leader. Joseph Seed. They call him the Father. And those in the outside world are blind. They do not believe. They have no faith. But I will make them see. Hey, Rookie. Rookie. You're wasting your time. There's no signal out here. Crossing over the hand bane now. How much longer? Just long enough for you to change your mind. So we can turn this bird around. You want me to ignore a federal warrant, Sheriff? No, sir. I want you to understand the reality of this situation. Joseph Seed, he's not a man to be fucked with. We've had run-ins with him before. They haven't always gone our way. Just sometimes. Sometimes it's best to leave well enough alone. Yeah, well, we have laws for a reason, Sheriff. And Joseph Seed's gonna learn that. Pratt, open a call with dispatch. 10 4. White Horse to dispatch, over. Hello, We're approaching the compound, Nancy. Over. Roger, Sheriff. You still planning to go through with this? Over. We are. Unfortunately, still trying to talk some sense in our friend, the Marshal. Over. All right. Lucky I'm not there. If you get into any trouble, you just let me know. Over. Ten four, over and on. Maybe we should have brought Nancy along with us instead of the probie. These Peggy's wouldn't fuck with her. Pratt. Why do you keep calling them Peggy's? Project at Eden's Gate. P.E.G. Peggy's is what the locals call them. You know, they started off harmless enough a few years back, but now they are armed to the teeth. You know, they're looking for a fight. Are you scared, Sheriff? We're here. Compound's just below. <sighs> oh, my Jesus. This is a bad idea. Last chance, Marshal. <sighs> We're going in. Roger that. Dispatch, you still there? Yes, go ahead, Sheriff. You don't hear from us in 15 minutes. Send in everyone. Call the goddamn National Guard if you have to. Over. Yes, sir, Sheriff. I'll be praying for you. Now listen up. Three rules. Stick close. Keep your guns in your holsters. And let me do the top. You got it? Got it. Rookie! All right, everyone. Stay sharp. Let's go!
They'll be in the church. Stick close. Eyes open. These folks can spook easily. Rook, find me. Stay loose, huh? What are they doing here? Be calm. Stay calm, everyone. Just go about your business. This doesn't concern you. Sheriff, I don't like this. Everything's fine, Nancy. Everything's just fine. Jesus Christ. You're wearing badges, aren't you? Yeah, but they don't respect badges much in here. They'll respect a nine millimeter. Not every problem can be solved with a bullet, Marshal. started the project because we know what happens next they will come they will try to take from us take our guns take our freedom take our faith we will not let them sheriff come on hold on Marshall. we will not let their greed or their immorality or their depravity hurt us anymore sheriff there will be no more right. suffering no, Joseph C. I have a warrant issued for your arrest on the suspicion of kidnapping with the intent to harm. Now, I want you to step forward and keep your hands where I can see them. There they are, the locusts in our garden. See, they've come for me. They've come to take me away from you. They've come to destroy all that we've built. Do not touch that service weapon! Hold on and don't stand down! Stand down! Everyone calm down! We knew this moment would come. We've prepared for it. Go. Go. God will not let them take me. As it were the noise of thunder, one of the four beasts say, Come and see. Step forward. And I saw. And behold, it was a white horse. And hell followed with him. Rookie, cuff this son of a bitch. God will not let you take me. Rook, put the cuffs on him. Sometimes the best thing to do is to walk away. Let's go. Take point, we're going right. On it. Stay on the path, rookie. Keep 
keep up. I am a federal marshal. I'm ordering you to stand back. Just fine here. No need to call anyone. Yes, Father. Praise be to you. No one is coming to save you. Father! Hurry up! God has kept you under the shadow of his wings. Everything is unfolding according to God's plan. I am still here with you. The first seal has been broken. The collapse has begun. But we will take what we need. We will preserve what we have. And we will kill all those who stand in our way. And these, the harbingers of doom, will see the truth.
Jesus Christ. Rook, I'm sorry. I thought they got you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Check the room, Rook. Oh, Jesus. I had no idea. Putting his whole family away. All of them. Fucking lunatics. We're gonna get out of this, rookie. First things first, gotta arm ourselves. Here. All right. Here's what we're gonna do there's a road out there. We're gonna take it, we're gonna head northeast. It's probably only a few hours back to Missoula. And then. We're gonna come back here with a goddamn National Guard, and we're gonna take out the rest of these... Okay, shh.
I'd be dead if it weren't for you. We gotta get back, but we gotta be smart. We don't know who we can trust. Fucking Nancy. Oh no. Oh no. They got the roads blocked.
thanks to God. The day I have prophesied to you has arrived. Everything I told you has come true. The authorities who tried to take me from you are now in the loving embrace of my family. Save for one. You know what that shit means? It means the roads have all been closed. It means the phone lines have been cut. It means there's no signals getting in and out of this valley. But mostly it means we're all fucked. Goddamn collapse. They all think the world's coming to an end now. They've been waiting for it, for years. Waiting for somebody to, to come along and fulfill their prophecy and kick off their goddamn holy war. Well, you sure as shit kicked. <sighs> Smartest thing for me to do would just be to hand you over. <sighs> Get out of that uniform. We need to burn it. There's some fresh clothes there. When you get changed, you come and see me. We'll see if we can unfuck this situation.
I didn't properly introduce myself back there. Most folks call me Dutch. I've been trying to piece together what's happening up top. It ain't good. The little I can gather is that your partners are alive for now. Seems they've been split up, each one handed off to a different member of Joseph's family. You want them back, I get it, I get it. I got friends that have been taken too. Problem is, there ain't no help coming. Nobody knows what's going on here, and they won't know until it's too late. There's got to be people out there willing to fight back against this cult. We just, we need to show them how. We need to build us a resistance. So the first thing we're going to do is get control of this island. Once we got some breathing room, we can figure out what's coming next. There's a gun and a map in the safe over there. Take them. I'll give you a call on your radio once you get your bearings. are willing to die for that psychopath that's leading them. Alongside you, if you help them. 
Second, you can destroy Eden's Gate property that's all over the place now. Hell, they built two goddamn shrines on this island alone. Third, you can tackle resistance missions. There are a lot of folks out there waging their own war against this cult. And they could sure use your help. And last, if you're really looking for a fight, you can take on the cult outposts that have popped up across the county. Liberating those places will give the Resistance solid footholds to push back against Eden's Gate. I've got cameras set up all over this island. I'll keep an eye out for anything useful. For now, head south and take out any culture you see. And help any folks in need, would you? Don't you? Fools are gonna mess up. Wait for him. You! I need you to help! Thanks for saving my sorry ass. <clears throat> These loony fanatics are out of control. If you want to protect yourself, I think there's a prepper stash near the boathouse. Should have some good gear squirreled away. Back in the garage. Sneaky bastards. Hey, Henry. I I'm at the edge of the wood near where you spotted the fire sign. I don't know what that showboater was doing buzzing the treetops, but the sky is now clear air traffic. That smoke plume is pretty thick, but I need a closer look. What I can't figure out is what all these peggies are doing out here. God There's a whole bunch of them in the land. Not some
believe I got caught. Please rescue me. I was a dead man. Thank. I've got a bone to pick with that cult. You have my contact. Hey, deputy. Now that you're partnered up, the two you should head to the forest research station. Ghost's been crawling all over that place, using it as a depot for their goddamn bliss. Clear them all out. Send a message. We're not fucking around anymore. You may want to build some dynamite. Luckily, folks around here have been stockpiling all the materials you might need. So just grab them up and get crafting.
Joseph's love gives me the strength to accomplish anything. It won't be me. But someone else has done it. Whoa! I'm talking to Sam! Go! go! Copy that! Fight for all! You're an angel. Thank you. The cult's been creeping around the island for weeks. Looks like they're trying to set up a base of operations at the old ranger station.
Nothing like taking someone else's junk and turning it into something useful. Father knows deeply of sin. It's a poison that clouds our minds. What if I told you you could be free from sin? What if I told you that everything you ever dreamed could come true? What if I told you that everything could be overcome if you embraced an idea? That freedom from sin can come from the power of just one word. Watching this, know that you have been selected. You will be cleansed, you will confess your sins, and you will be offered atonement. Don't worry. You don't have to do anything. We'll come for you. Welcome to Eden's Gate. Falls End. 